Previously on The Potentialists. Challenge, truth or dare. With my teeth? Woo! Got it. Just to give someone give a lap dance. We're not doing this to a stranger. <laughs> Anyone can entertain you, but only we edutain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Get ready to make it happen. In consideration for the confidentiality of our more high-profile Power Journey attendees, we have protected some of the participants' identities in order to preserve their best interests. It's been crazy. It's been awesome. It's been up, down, all around. What the hell's going on? And the first thing that was going on today was to teach networking techniques. And what not a better place to do that than at a local mixer. The networking thing is so not my scene, not a fan. That's a networking event. Period. It's not always the standing up and going back and forth. Right now, looking at what we're looking at, time is money. Oh, okay. Well, the networking was fun. It was brief, and that kind of pissed me off. I was just getting into it, and then we got pulled. We have to pre-qualify. We need to know if there's enough building relationship. Sometimes we build too much relationship. Oh, come on, show us what you got. Strut. Come on, strut. Show us what you got. After some intense lessons, they then relax at a massage parlor. I'm getting a foot massage. This beats all uh, eating out of trash cans. <laughs> this is very, very girly for me. Yes, I am not a girly girl at all, but I'm enjoying it. I guess God I'm good with the chair. The chair it works for me. I enjoyed the, the pampering. Don't really need the girliness, but... And after grabbing a quick bite to eat, they headed off to a red carpet affair. I don't know what to expect around here. That's the thing, you just don't know what to expect. The March of the Peabody Ducks is a long-standing tradition going on since 1933. It's a great American tradition. Ladies and gentlemen, they retire for the evening. An evening of leisure and dinner. If you care to join them up at the Royal Duck Palace, you're more than welcome to do so. They'll be back promptly tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock for breakfast. Don't miss it. It's an entirely different experience. Enjoy your evening. And wanting to see what kind of palace was fit for a Peabody duck, the team explored the penthouse. That's a typical one. Oh, that's cool. Not what I expected. Yeah, not at all. That is not a palace. No. No. <laughs> no. That no. is not what I expected. They just spelled it. It it's should be the place. It's been crazy. It's been awesome. It's been up, down, all around. What the hell is going on? Back at the house, another round of truth or dare was in order. This side? What is truth or one or is this dare? Side. That side. This side? Sure. And then we did the truth or dare, which got to be wild. Names and places or settings you'd like to be sexual in. Really? Let me think back to when I was having sex. <laughs> <laughs> Dared person rule breaker must lick the palm of the team player that is to your right ten times. Lick the what of me? Give me your palm. My palm? Your palm. Ooh. Oh. 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 Oh, that was like her. Give me your ball. I just think oh, ten times. Ten times. Okay, one more, please. One more, please. Come on. Oh, what is that? Not not right. Right. Dude, oh, she's getting frustrated, man. That she's going to be No, thank you. Why is it? Why is it? Bitch. <laughs> Smear jelly in one armpit and peanut butter in the other armpit oh. of dear person. Then take two slices of bread and wipe it off and then eat the whole sandwich. Uh. Oh, God. But it <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is your own Jimmy, 
eating wheat bread now. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord. Okay. Well. Huh. At least it's the last one that you can go shower. <laughs> Whoa. Hi, I'm Dylan. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe so you can make it happen with Bow World.